Okay, folks, uh, let me show you what I've made uh, in Reaper. I've made a live setup with the live configs. It works pretty well. I've had uh, some experiences, experiences for uh, over a year now with some other live hosts. And um, yeah, some crashed or some were buggy. And setting this up in Reaper wasn't that easy for me. Um, I've been searching for some uh, problems, also some small bugs or features that were not uh, in it uh, to get it working. But I think it's okay now. Uh, I've not used it live. <laughs> we'll know, know it uh, pretty soon. So uh, let me show you how it works and how, uh, how I've uh, set up everything. I've made uh, two screen setups. This is for live use. And I've made some buttons to quickly click between it. So if I push this one, you have this one, live setup, and this one is the editing panel, all the panels you need for editing. So you can hide them also with these buttons, of course. So for the first uh, setup, it's best that you add all the tracks that you're gonna need. As you see, I have like four instances of um, Send one. I have two on two other channels, channels five and six. My guitars, um, Dimension, maybe some Proteus, Vocoder, and everything we'll see later. Uh, you can enable them with the tracks here. You can bypass, bypass them also here. I've set all the windows floating, so it's pretty easy. And this is the main way though, so I've made it <laughs> really small, as you see. And yeah, so to uh, to create a voice, you just work with the snapshots. So for example, if I push call me, you see it loads two instances of uh, send one. For the first time it takes a while, but once it's there it goes uh, pretty fast. So the sound is quicker than um, than the, the GUI as you see. Where is the panel, the mixer panel, here it is, yeah. So what I've done, I've used Cake's MIDI filter to make the split. So I put two instances of this one. There are other uh, possibilities also here for filtering everything. You can just click this away or if you're not, yeah, I like guess. Okay. Um, yeah. And uh, let's select the guitars, for example. Where are the guitars? Guitars, yeah, here. So, if you don't need the guitars, you don't have to um, disable them because it takes too much um, memory and time to load. So you can hide them uh, also, or bypass them. Makes it uh, load much quicker. Um, when you select the snapshots, or you set up your um, your tracks, yeah, you can save it by control clicking um, guitars, for example. Now it's saved. Later on, you will. Um, Add it all to the list and recall the snapshots that you need for the songs. I don't use an input track. Um, here are the, the options, it's all on. On learn, I've made apply live config on a rotary on my MIDI keyboard. So when I go to the first one, the second one, see, third one. Takes a bit, yeah. Here it is. Uh, I found a problem with um, 
the doors or uh, windows that keep open. So when you have other instances loaded and you don't need guitars, you click them away, but they come back when you save it. That's because uh, live configs um, doesn't rem remember the floating state of a window. So what I've done, I've put all the, the stuff that I don't need, but is still loaded in the background, I've put it here, as you see. Because when you do this and you save it, it comes back here, so we don't want this. So let's uh, see to switch. Yeah, let's go back to the guitars. Yeah. Um, let's go to another one. Call me. Yeah, I've taken uh, taken a half a second for uh, loading time. Maybe it's too short. Um, so the rotary waits a half a second before uh, you rotate to the next one. So maybe it's too short in life situations when you uh, dial another one. So maybe I will put it to one second. I'll see for this for this. <laughs> Uh, let's see, hot stuff. So yeah, I think it will work out pretty fine. It goes uh, quick, it loads pretty fast. It's stable. It's uh, uh, the latency is really, really low. It's incredible <laughs> what you can do with Reaper. Yeah, it's amazing. So um, yeah, I'll try it out live and I'll let you know what I uh, what I found of it. Thanks.